close, but I think you understand the picture how we will explain this a little bit. So without further ado, uh, please have a drink. But we will start with Robert because I missed Robert yesterday. I sidetracked with my thinking and uh, missed him and uh, so he got lost. Today you get first. Ah, there you go. Thank you. Um, Unfortunately, I'm not an artist, I'm only a sculptor, so um, <laughs> I really don't belong in this group of uh, artists and their works, but um, look, actually it's very hard to talk about my work because my work's three-dimensional and it's, uh, it's a language which doesn't really transform or transcribe into a verbal language. But when you start talking about form and uh, spaces, negative and positive spaces and etc. planes and angles. It's very hard to describe it on a piece of sculpture whereas you really have to look at it, touch it, feel it, pick it up and get an indication of the material that's been used or that it's finished in. Generally I start with a, some wire, make up an armature if I'm doing a horse and then start rubbing the clay and the wax over it until I get it finished and it looks fine, happy with it, then I take a mould off it and cast it. But sometimes you'll work on a number of pieces and they'll never work out, they just end up in the clay bin or the plasticine bin or the wax bin and you just start again. Or you work for a quite a period of time, finish a piece, I excuse me about the sunglasses but I get the reflection in the eyes from the sun there. Um, and you work for a long time, you get it finished, and you look at your thing and it's not what I want, it didn't work out as well, so you crumble it up and start again, or you leave it for a period of time, and you come back and you look at it, oh, that's what's wrong with it. The worst part about it is sometimes you get lost, or I do, you get lost in my time, and I start early in the morning, and five or six o'clock in the evening, I'll stop and I'll think, oh my God, I haven't even been in the toilet, so I'll cough you <laughs> Then you come back, you look at the work, and you start working on it. The work till 10, 11 o'clock at night, and you think, ah, terrific. You come back the next morning, you look at it, and you go, oh my God, what a mess. It just didn't work out, it looks better when you see it in a fresh light. So, that's about it, I'm afraid. Mm. <laughs> Not much more I can tell you. All I can yeah. say is just look at the works and thank you. Buy them. <laughs> 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 